All right, I got to ask you the question. Stitches versus Roy Jones. Man, which one is crazier? All right, so this is a boxing website, so of course y'all know who Roy Jones is. But let me catch you up to date to who Stitches is. Stitches is this white guy rapper that says he's gangster, shoots videos with nothing but guns, I'm talking about he's going to hit you with a brick in your face. He's been getting a lot of buzz and attention lately because he's been calling out that rapper the game. Now, apparently, I don't even know what the, the beef and dispute was about, but he's been calling out the game. He was rolling by stalking him at the club. Couldn't wait for him to come out the club so he can catch a fair, fair one with him one-on-one. -on -one. Well, apparently, he was videotaping it the whole time, posting to his Instagram and all this other stuff, social media. Apparently, uh, the game and his entourage finally came out of the club, and Stitches just felt, I mean, he's a big white boy now. Don't get me wrong with tattoos all over his face. If you're a person that's intimidated by looks, he would definitely scare you. But anyway, he rolled up to say something to the, to the game, and the game's manager rolled right up on him. Blat out. Caught him right on the jaw. The man, Stitches, was out. Cops came along. He tried to get back in his car. They arrested him. Now, according to the game's manager, he got arrested too, and they were in a jail cell together. And the game's manager was like, yo, we can fight right here, but he says Stitches didn't want any of it. But anyway, needless to say, right after he got knocked out by the game's manager, this guy came right back on his Instagram and all that, talking about, yeah, your manager knocked me out, but you didn't. Come on, let's catch a fair one. I'm like, dude, you don't know when to stop? Are you kidding me? Then the very same day or the next day, I don't know if the game paid Stitch's people and gave them money. Then Stitch's own people, his own homeboys beat him up. Beat him down. Then the next day, he does another Instagram post with his eyes swollen, lip busted up. It looked like he needed Stitch's. And the guy still, still talks smack. Yeah, but it ain't going to happen again. You ain't going to knock me out or jump me again. You better believe that. In game, I still want a fair one. One-on-one. -on -one. Come on. I'm like, dude, you've already been knocked out. Your, your boys jumped you and beat you up. I mean, you keep taking loss after loss, and you're still talking about you want to keep going. Now, the reason why I put Stitches versus Roy Jones, which one is crazier? Because Roy falls in the same boat. He keeps getting knocked out, but he keeps wanting to keep going. I'm like, dude, how many losses, how many knockouts do you want to keep taking? Why? Why? You're messing up your legacy. Unlike Stitches, he had no legacy. He's just now coming up, and he's eating off the fame, and he's getting attention. But, Roy, all the boxing people, you just like Stitches. Y'all don't know how to take a knockout, a beating loss, and just quit and just shut your mouth. I'm reading here and Roy talking about, yeah, I lost, but I ain't done yet. Yes, you are. You're like stitches. Y'all need to go sit down somewhere and stop it. This is getting ridiculous. Listen, y'all leave your thoughts, comments below. Let me know what you think about the Roy Jones wanting to continue fighting. Make sure you subscribe or else.